Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we revisit NASA's Voyager 1 and its discoveries about Saturn's rings, from their complexity to their stunning beauty. During its flyby in 1980, Voyager 1 captured detailed images of Saturn's rings, offering unprecedented views of their structure. Scientists were able to study the ring's thickness, composition, and intricate patterns for the first time. Voyager 1 revealed that Saturn's rings aren't uniform. Instead, they contain thousands of tiny ringlets and gaps, with variations in particle density. These observations helped scientists understand how gravitational forces shape the rings. The spacecraft discovered that small moons, later called shepherd moons, orbit near the ring's edges and influence their shape. These moons keep the rings sharply defined and prevent them from dispersing into space. The pioneering space probe instruments analyzed the light reflected from the rings, confirming they are composed mostly of water ice, with some dust and rock. This insight explained the bright, reflective appearance of Saturn's rings. Observations showed that Saturn's rings are not static. The particles collide, clump together, and slowly drift, creating waves and ripples across the rings. Voyager 1's data revealed that rings are dynamic, ever-changing systems. The probe discovered numerous gaps in the rings, the most famous being the Cassini division. These gaps are caused by gravitational interactions with Saturn's moons, offering scientists a natural laboratory to study orbital mechanics. Voyager 1's discoveries laid the groundwork for later missions like Cassini, which explored Saturn and its rings in even greater detail. The data continue to help scientists understand ring formation, evolution, and their role in planetary systems. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.